puppies. It's Miss Natalie, and I miss seeing you guys so much tonight. But that's okay, because you can watch me on your mommy and daddy's phone, and we can still be together and learn about Jesus. And that is so exciting, and I cannot wait for the next time we see each other, because we will. We just may have to do this for a little bit, okay? So this week's um, verse is Psalms 51, 4, against you, and we're talking about God, have I sinned? Mm, that's a good one. So you guys keep working on that this week, okay? Psalms 51, 4, against you, God, have I sinned? All right, so we talked about Adam and Eve sinning last week, didn't we? Or the week before, and how they had one rule, and they broke that rule. So we're going to learn more about it today, okay? So I have our pictures just like we do every week. So you can look at here, and it kind of explains what I'm talking about. Remember last week? Here's Adam, and here's Eve, and this light is God, isn't it, when you're talking to him? Okay. So, cubbies, last week we remember talking about Adam and Eve. And they lived in the beautiful garden of Eden. But God put them in charge of taking care of the garden and all the animals. Everything was perfect. They always felt happy. They never felt scared or sad or alone. They could talk to God every day. Wouldn't that just be amazing? God gave Adam one rule. Now, all of us, we have lots of rules, don't we? Like clean our room or pick up our dirty clothes. But Adam had one, but it was a big one. Does anybody remember what that was? We talked about it last week. Okay. It, God said Adam and Eve could not eat the fruit from the tree of life and every other tree in the garden, but they could not eat from the fruit and the, the tree in the middle of the garden, the tree of knowledge of good and evil. There was just one tree. They could eat off any of the other trees, but not that one. So, so here's all the animals. In the trees, but here's one tree, okay, that they could not eat from. They could eat from this tree or that one or that one, any of these. So they weren't that limited. They had the one rule. If they did, they would die. And that was the truth because God's word is truth. That was last week's, huh? Everything we read in our Bible is truth. It's a true story. It really happened. One day, a serpent came to talk to Eve. The Bible doesn't tell us what the serpent looked like, but the Bible does say that the serpent was the sneakiest of the creatures. He pretended to be nice, but he was really Satan in disguise. The serpent asked Eve a question. Did God really say you couldn't eat from any of or couldn't eat from any tree in the garden. Oh, we may eat from the trees, said Eve, but God told us not to eat from the tree in the middle of the garden or even touch it. If we do, we'll die. You won't die, the serpent lied. If you eat this fruit, you will be wise like God. Wise, like God, he wanted to be wise. Kind of like we think our mommy and daddies are wise. And we want to be big and, and wise like them. And the fruit sure looked delicious. Eve decided to believe the serpent's lie instead of God's truth. So here is the tree and oh, it does look tasty. But God's truth never lies. She reached up and picked a piece of fruit and took 
gigabyte. Ooh, that's a big no-no. She gave, let's see here. I think I'm, that's Eve talking to the serpent, the snake, which is Satan. Oh, Adam, he didn't do it. He's going to do it, but she was the first one. And then we're going to get to there. She gave some of the fruit to Adam. See her taking a bite, saying, mm, that's tasty. And she's giving it to Adam. Ooh, but God told both of them not to eat that. She gave some of the fruit to Adam, who was with her, and he ate it too. They both ate it, and that was the one rule they were not supposed to do, and they both did it. Oh, no. Right away, they felt different. They wanted to cover their faces. They wanted to cover their bodies. They didn't want to be seen. So it's not just their tummy got upset, but all of a sudden, they just didn't feel right. And before, they felt just wonderful. Adam and Eve sinned. Remember we talked about sin a few weeks ago? Because God gave them one rule, and they broke it. So they sinned. Cubbies, we all have sinned, haven't we? Yeah, we have. Psalms 51.4, our verse this week. Against you, God, have I sinned. We all have I sinned. Everyone sinned. Um, Adam and Eve knew they had disobeyed God. When they heard the Lord walking to the garden, they ran to hide behind the trees. They were afraid to talk to God. Cubbies, I wonder what happened next. What do you think? Do you think they got in trouble? Do you think uh, they died like God said they would? Do you think God still loved them, even though he gave them one rule and they disobeyed it? Well, I know God still loved them, and we are going to find out next week what exactly God did. Because when we break rules, we get disciplined, don't we? Like when mommy and daddy gives you a rule, and you just disobey it, and that's sin, and they, you normally get in trouble, like going to time out, or get one of your toys taken away. Well, Adam and Eve are going to have to get disciplined because they broke the one rule. But for good news, no matter what they did, God loves them. And he loves us, even though we sin, because it says, I have sinned. He loves us so much. He loves you more than anything in this world. So sometimes when we disobey, we have to get punished. Like we're going to learn next week, so make sure you, we're either going to be here or stay tuned, and we're going to figure out how. But no matter what, God loves us. And I love you, Cubbies, and I miss you. And make sure you're working on your verses because we're still, even if we don't meet, we still get our patches and we still want to, you know, store God's word in our heart because that's what we're supposed to be doing so we know it. So one more time, this week's verse. Psalms 51, 4, against you, God, have I sinned. Okay, puppy? So you keep talking to mommy and daddy about Jesus, and I can't wait to see you guys, and I miss you. Bye.